Hey, this is Greg Shields, and you found another of my courses in this learning path on Windows Server 2016. This time on the challenging but rewarding tasks in making Windows servers highly available. I am author evangelist and a full-time author here at Pluralsight, and I've been managing HA services like failover clustering since the days of Microsoft Wolfpack. Microsoft has invested significant time and energy in improving the high availability experience in Windows Server 2016, and not just for your Hyper-V workloads. Technologies like failover clustering have matured significantly over the past few OS versions to create an HA solution that you probably actually will want this time to implement. This one's going to be good. But failover clustering is not all that Microsoft brings to bear for HA. In this course, we'll look at the live migration and Hyper-V replica features now available for your standalone Hyper-V hosts. We'll spend a minute with an ancient and yet mature technology in network load balancing. All this alongside a significant exploration into the design, construction, management, and use of Windows failover clustering, not just for Hyper-V, but all your HA needs. If you've just been tasked with adding high availability to your Windows Server 2016 workloads, this course is your first stop in brushing up on those skills for success. And then from here, you'll be ready to continue on the learning path as you explore the maintenance and monitoring of your Windows Server environment. Let's get started.